Good day grade 11s, welcome to your first lesson in week 27. We're carrying on with trigonometry and in this lesson we're going to be teaching you the area rule. So this time we're going to be using trigonometry to find the area of a triangle. So this is the proof for it. So you guys know that the area of a triangle, a basic area of the triangle, area of a triangle is equal to half the base times the height, right? Half the base times the height. So now we're going to prove for, to you that the area of the triangle can be given as a half AB sine C, a half AB sine C. So let me show you how we're going to do this. First of all, what I've given you here is a triangle, we have called it ABC, and we have therefore dropped a perpendicular down from A down onto the line BC and we've called that H. So normally we would have gone that the area in this case would have been a half and then the base would have been A and the height would have been H. Okay, but let's pretend that we don't have this length here. This is a theoretical length. So let's see how we would get H. So I am going to highlight the triangle we're going to use and because we want sine C we're going to use this triangle here. So we're going to use this triangle here and because I've said that we want sine C what do we do? We know that we're going to use sine. So let's talk about Sokotoa and Please understand the reason I'm using Sokoto is because I've dropped this perpendicular down which means this is a right angle triangle which means I can go back to using my Sokoto. So this is my right angle triangle. We know that sine, so we know that sine is opposite over hypotenuse and we want the sine of C. So sine of C is equal to the opposite side of C, which is going to be little h, over the hypotenuse, which in this triangle happens to be little b, b. So therefore we can say that b times sine c is equal to h. But remember we said that the area of the triangle, area of the triangle, is equal to half times the base times the perpendicular height which in this case is going to be a half times the base of this triangle and the base of this triangle is BC which has been designated the little a times the perpendicular height H which we have just proven is equal to B sine C and there we've just proven that you can get the area of a triangle to equal half a b sine c. Grade 11s you need to be able to prove this and in the next lesson we'll be showing you how you will use this in different examples. Have a great day.